This is Twit. Jesse is in Long Beach, our next caller. Hi, Jesse. How you doing, Leo? I'm well. How are you? All right. I'm calling on behalf of my wife. She's having problems with her uh, iPhone 6 Plus. Yes, dear. She's complaining about pictures and videos. She doesn't have enough room. On her. <laughs> you know why? <laughs> she doesn't why delete that? pictures and video when oh. she's copying them to the computer and it just fills up. Oh, okay. How big of an iPhone did she get? She got the 16 gig. 16, yeah, that's the smallest, right? So yeah, but, it fills yeah, up faster. Old, but the old phone used to be able to take like 10,000 10, pictures, and this one you can only take 3,000 pictures and maybe like two or three videos. Okay, so, yeah. And it's probably a bad idea just to keep them on the phone forever because what if you lose the phone? Yeah. Then you lost, true. now you only lose 3,000 pictures. In the old days, you'd lose 10,000 pictures. So, yeah. yeah, there is less space. iOS 8 is bigger, uh, and there's and the pictures are bigger and nicer and so there's less space for them what was her old phone uh the 4s no, yeah the oh the five. five yeah yeah so these are so you know these are higher resolution pictures video is higher quality so the key is do you ever hook it up to a computer uh yes she does okay mm -hmm. so next time you hook it up to the computer and it copies all the photos make sure you copy all the photos it'll say okay do you want me to delete the old photos now oh okay and say this time say yes Free up space. <laughs> she never says yes. She says, no, I like that because I want to show pictures to friends and family. I understand that. I'm going to give her some ways to do that, okay? So right. if she uses Facebook and you have the Facebook app on your phone, there's a setting in the Facebook app that says, copy all my pictures whenever I take them to a private, very important, private place on Facebook. Now all the pictures are on Facebook. She can share them with family and friends. Even if she just has the phone, she can open up Facebook and look at them on the phone, just as if they're on the phone, but they take up no space on the phone. They're all stored on Facebook. Uh, if she uses Google+, Plus, it'll do the same thing. If you like Microsoft, OneDrive will do the same thing. If she uses Flickr, Flickr will do the same thing. All of these... You download the app, Smug Mug, I can go on and on, lots of apps. You download the app, you turn on photo uploading, and uh, whenever you take, I use Google+. Plus. I happen to love that. If, if you've got a Google account, you already have a Google+, Plus account. Uh, you download the Google+, Plus app. It will upload every picture. It will upload every video privately. On, don't worry, don't get scared. Only you can see them. Now when you say, when you go to grandma's uh, and you say, here's pictures of the baby, you know, you, you ever do that? You can sit, you can yeah. sit, they're still there. See, I know why, I know why you want to keep them on the phone because you want to show people. But the problem yeah. is the phone can't, 3,000, come on, 3,000 pictures is a lot of pictures. She was used to 10,000, I yeah, guess. Yeah, well, let's, let's, so I'm glad you've been copying them to the computer. That's good. And by the way, it'd be a good idea to copy them to Facebook or Flickr or both at the same time because that way if the computer hard drive crashes, you lose your phone. You know, I've had heart-rending calls from people. We had a call last year. guy called up and said, um, I've, my dog died a couple of years ago, and the only pictures I have of him are on my phone, and I just lost it. Is there any way? And I said, well, no. You have to make sure you back up those pictures, right? So those are precious, precious pictures. Make sure you back them up to the computer. But now do turn on the photo backup in Facebook or turn on the photo. I, you know, if you use Flickr, which is free, it's from Yahoo, F-L-I-C-K-R, download the app and turn on the uploading. You can share it with friends and family on Flickr, too. You can send them a link. Those are higher quality, by the way, than Facebook. Facebook squishes them a little bit. So if you want to preserve the full quality, I would use Flickr or Google+. Plus. Um, but all of these are free, cost you nothing. And they give you basically unlimited storage. For instance, Flickr, it's a terabyte. Your phone is 16 gigabytes. This is 1,000 gigabytes. Wow. Uh, okay. <laughs> so you're not going to run out. 20 years from now, you'll call me and you say, I have great grandchildren pictures and I want to make sure. And I'll say, they're all there. So, okay. So start deleting them from the phone as you go. That's okay. Make sure, though, if you do that, that you have it turned on, that they're uploading not only the computer but another source so you have two copies. In fact, you can do Flickr and Facebook. The only thing I would do is if you have limited bandwidth, you know, you have a, a limit on how much data you can use on your phone, 
there's a box that says on Wi-Fi only. Make sure you check that. So it only uploads those pictures when you're home. And that okay. and that way it won't use any data. It won't use any of your data plan. All right, Leo. Well, thank you so much. You're welcome. I'm glad we could save the day. Amazon does this too, by the way. Unlimited. Amazon says unlimited. You can have 10 terabytes. We don't care. Now, the thing to remember is that uh, when you're storing it on a company's site, that it's only going to be backed up there as long as that company's in business. I figure Amazon, Microsoft, Apple does this too, by the way. You can turn on iCloud, but you have to pay for that. So I'm, I'm giving you free stuff. Facebook's going to be around in 20 years. Yeah. So all those places are, are safe. I actually do them, all of them. So I do OneDrive, which gives you unlimited storage if you're an Office user, which I am. I do to Flickr, unlimited, a terabyte of storage. I do it to Google Drive, terabyte. I have a terabyte there. That's, you're never going to run out of space. I, and I, I can't tell you how common this is, by the way. This is so common. Very few people, I don't know why, very few people ever delete pictures from their iPhones. I, it's just, they, it, I guess you just want them all, right? Well, there's an alternative for you. Thanks, Jesse.